everything that we did got undone. This video is sponsored by Cove. It's not a work day, Josh. Tie that beard up. It's time to party. Right. Commuter 2 by Cove Audio is a Bluetooth stereo speaker system with 360 degree surround sound. It connects to smartphones, tablets, and computers via Bluetooth. Just stay straight, I'll guide you up. All right. The powerful subwoofer delivers superior sound and it operates for up to seven hours on a single battery charge. And when split, they create optimal left and right stereo sound. The speaker can be up to 33 feet away from your mobile device or computer and still play without interruption. Click the link in the description box below to get 67% off your order. Great to tell the kids? I'm ready. Go. Go fast today. He's gonna go fast? Yeah. <laughs> you better buckle up. I know these winding roads will lead me on to you. Babe, did you just take us back in time to the 80s? Like, how are you gonna it might get- be before the 80s. I bet you it's before the 80s. How are you those gonna... are old pumps. I know. How are you gonna get gas out of those? I don't even think I know how to work those. I go outside and pay first. I have to take card. <laughs> they get filled up first, then you go outside and pay. So you used to be back in the day. I would ask. I would ask first. <laughs> that works. Yep. So you used to be back in the day. You fill up first and you go inside and pay. Looks like you're gonna need to make a U-turn. Sorry about that. I'm not surprised. <laughs> you, you are the, the time. you are the worst navigator <laughs> with I a know. map in your hand that tells you which way to go. You still get me to the wrong wrong spot every time. Hey, I can't be good at everything, Josh. Right? Are you there yet? No. 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 Almost. Bunch of trails and uh, some are muddy, some aren't, so we'll see what we hit first. We'll see how it goes. See where the day takes us. Yeah, put this, thing, <laughs> put this guy to the test, see what he can do. Can you line me up real quick, make sure I'm good. I put it behind the tires, I'm gonna back up a little bit, get the tires to the uh, ramp, make sure we're good. Yeah. You're good. Take it anyways, you know, you can start in the green. You want to start with the weak sauce one? I mean, scary stuff, so we might have some good overlooks. Let's do it, right? Yeah, but it says on the map, live on the edge, rocky of it, trail. Josh. It says scary him down. Good, nice view. I got one of those looking at you, baby. All right, thank you. Hey. That's the orange trail? Yeah, What's Dad, up? let's go through the muddy ones.
did. <laughs> I'm completely. Way to wash the truck off. Right? I'm completely off. drenched. I'm completely. <laughs> Person crying, I got mud in my eyes. I should have my goggles on. Alright. No more mud puddles, okay? Oh, God. No more mud. We're getting ready to go through, and Josh yelled for everybody to keep their mouths shut. <laughs> This is not right But there's something else tells you it's time to take That's how you feel, right? Yeah! Who had fun? Stars over Morning. <laughs> Dad? It's okay. Are you building the deck today? Do you want to help? I am. You helping? No, I don't. You don't? No. Do you want to do you want to build a pool? <gasps> Are you gonna help build that? Yeah. I'm giving you a shovel. You go outside and start, start digging. You want to? Have you seen Dad do a cannonball before? Okay. Well, Mom does it, all the water comes out of the pool. I'll just insert a photo of Dad doing a cannonball with his floaty right right here. If you were not, that's gonna be a big deck. Everyone likes big decks, Josh. Especially you. <laughs> that's how we're married, obviously. So, so I had all my control marks and stakes in there, so I can, all I can do is pull my string down, pull my string down to. Uh, that's how I know where, where, where everything is. We measured down, and it's all squared up. It's perfect, okay? We had the corners in the ground. I saw you pulling that one out. I told you not to do it because we needed a square. It's already marked and laid out. Come to find out, three days later, we're back here doing stuff at like all cures. She pulled that one out also. Thing about it is, my colleague needed to be able to back our truck up without hitting the stake. So, you, you know, I just out, moved it out of the way. Concrete driver. She drives a truck for a concrete company. Employee of the month. <laughs> 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 but I don't think we need to put it back in, you know what I mean? Because if, it, if everything looks straight, it's straight, or so I was told. Well, that comes from a person with the right leg an inch shorter than the left, so. <laughs> <laughs> that way, if I stand on my right leg, I'm about as tall as you. <laughs> okay. uh, that, that's pretty funny. <laughs> <laughs> I can see we're getting nothing done today. <laughs> Perfect. We're square. On the 
money. Perfecto on the money. Like square square. You know what I mean? For the talking, you've been talking lately. Got me thinking. So now that we have all of the strings back up and we are all laid out again, we can start finding the center point on all of the footers for our posts and then we can start installing the brackets. So we got our center points here. Since this side's done center points, we're gonna hit the next side, get that done, then put the brackets on this side and that side first where the storm's gonna come in. It's gonna wash everything away if we don't get it done. If we get those installed, everything's set in stone and squared, and we can bang the rest out after the storm. Okay. Okay? Yeah. Our hair out of square. I say leave it and just build the darn deck. No. No, fuck it no. Let's <laughs> move it out. It is. As right now, we've got to maneuver a few things. That's all. It just, it just coming off the house. It's the, the post just a little bit out. No big deal. <laughs> so we just gotta figure it out and make sure it's right. Build the deck. Build the deck. I can't do layout anymore. The layout's the worst. Why does it take so long? You gotta be perfect. You gotta be, it's an inch and a half out, angle to angle, so it's not good enough. It's just a, it's a little bit. You're a perfectionist, Josh. It's one of the reasons I love you. You never have a beard hair out of square. They're all perfectly alike. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> Don't patronize me. But it's such a beautiful, masculine, thick, Long beard, Josh. Lushes. I get it. Lushes. <laughs> you good? Yeah. We're dead now. Let's get those posts in line. We're perfect. It's exactly right. So all the spacing is proper the entire way down. Corner to corner, it's all square. So it's perfect. What do you think, big guy? Marks got washed away at the rain bed. You gotta relay it all out again. Make sure it's square, do the whole thing over again. And by the time we got all of the power tools away, it had already started raining. And it poured. And it poured. Yeah. And it washed away everything that we had spent at least. That like, mark is there. Yeah, I see that one. That this one I there don't is there. see though. Huh? I don't see any of these. No, they're those are all gone. All those are gone. So everything that we did got undone. Yes, yeah, so we gotta relay it all out and cross check everything to square it all up again. So that's what sucks. This, is, this is what we get for using a nice day of weather to enjoy a family day. <laughs> the universe is like, you must work. <laughs> no days off, you must uh, work. That's how it is, I guess, you know. <laughs> we squandered a good day, and now here we are doing it again. But we had fun. It was fun. <laughs> but this is not fun. I'm so over laying everything out. But the good thing is, the lines should be in the, in the right locations still. The right. jet line, or the mason line we pulled should be in the same location. But everything's not centered. We but, gotta go back and make all the center yes, marks. We gotta, we gotta go ahead and 
recheck that line to make sure an animal didn't hit his sheep and pull it out of whack. We gotta check that line first. Yeah. I don't, I lost it. It's right, it? it's right here. And it's coming right here. I see it right here. Yeah. That yeah. Right yeah, going right through there. Okay. And here's the horizontal one going right there. Right there, right? Is that it? Yeah. So in, in the words of Josh, it's, it's no big deal. <laughs> I mean, it sucks, you know, but it's not a big deal, we'll make it <laughs> Every drop of water, every drop of rain, every drop of blood coursing through my thirsty veins. So we're laid out again. Um, everything didn't get bumped as much as we kind of thought that it might have, so as long as we can get all of these brackets up before it starts raining again. It, who knows? We got we rain next fine. next three days on and off, so. Right. We just gotta work quickly and efficiently and you know bring home the proper supplies next time. It could rain any moment now. Okay, that's a day. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame you. I don't. That's, that's, that's definitely a jab and an uppercut. <laughs> Fill me up with fervor. Fill me up with hope. With the childish notion that you be coming home I heard your boots on gravel Winding down the fence In that misty morning fog Could it be? See, I lost my bit. Could it be? that gun. I hope they're driving our way to get another one. So, what the? I meant to sing <laughs> by hand. I think it's gonna come out. You should be good. First one's down, babe. Nine more to go, and then we get to do layout again. Yes. So much fun. We're moving now. We're rock and roll now, right? <laughs> you think? Yeah. Oof -da. I drill the holes, you come back, you crank down. Oh, that's not a bad idea. Right? Yeah. Perfect. I'll give it a try. Good. I need pure raw strength from you, and I need precision from me. See, that's why we're a match made in heaven, Josh. Yes. You're almost there, baby girl. Is that Just, it? Hold on. Make sure you're square though. Good. Good? Yes. Perfect. Perfect square too, you know? Good job. Thanks. Maybe my next job will be a deck builder. I think that'll be fitting, you know? I think I could really see that in my future. Than I am. Me? Yeah. I don't think I was going that fast. That. Ah, mother. <laughs> so how's he trying to go too fast to show off, Josh? <laughs> <laughs> that was straight. Yes. We did a fantastic, fantastic job, if I do say so. <laughs> <laughs> we're moving now, right? Yeah, we are. So that is no time at all. Yeah. We'll bang the other side out, and then all we're gonna do is this: pull a string. From center to center over top of that thing. Yeah. Pop it the entire way through and get center to center, and then we'll go from center all obviously that way and work way down and so, get the cross sections. So the center layout is going to be much faster and easier than everything else because yeah, we're all square and good established. everywhere. Yeah. It's all established. You know Perfect. what I mean? Perfect. It's all established. So it shouldn't be that bad. All right. My little freaking shin hurts. <laughs> you, know, you complimented me and didn't just speed up a little more and I got hurt. <laughs> I think it's cute, Josh. Uh, Still trying to impress me after all these years. It works too, usually. <laughs> Good.
So we've got the brackets on this side and the other side. They're all bolted down and ready to go with the anchors. We didn't use, we, I guess we didn't use this kind you put in place when the concrete cures because I didn't want to be out a little bit here or there so the deck would be square. We actually poured everything and then got everything squared up on the concrete and make sure everything was precise. And now we're drilling holes and anchoring them down that way so it's perfect. So, what else? Now we get to start layout on the rest of the Yes. Glitters. So we got 10 done, we got 15 left. We've always been goal-oriented, self-motivated people. I believe that's exactly how we got to where we are at today. We spent the years prior to moving and the last three years after the move dedicating each day to making progress in some area of our life. And that's a good thing. But as we've found comfort in the home we've built and this huge chunk of a goal being met, we've learned to just stop and not always worry about what the next goal is to meet. Just simply enjoy some of these mindless moments of doing nothing. <laughs> Woo, doggy! I've gotten real soft these days, you know? I almost got, almost got a paper cut yesterday. Almost. <laughs> when you're making dinner, I'm sorry. I drive concrete trucks now. I don't cook dinner, you do. I'm gone all day long. Well, you, you, you just got fired this by me, so I'm <laughs> cooking dinner tonight instead. <laughs> you need your wife back already? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> was that necessary? Yes. I thought it was. Maybe not. <laughs> you feel like Thor now? I look like Thor. The body of a Greek god. But the face of a hobbit. <laughs> <laughs>